Good Wednesday morning. He's a professional beach volleyball player with a new title, but he didn't get his start on the beaches of California or Florida. He learned at an apartment complex right here in Central Georgia in a town better known for football and baseball. An athlete who launched his career from a giant sandbox. The blue skies are the same. So is the sandy surface. But instead of seagulls, there are only thunderbirds and firebirds around, but they're grounded in the parking lot. Not the traditional backdrop for learning beach volleyball, but anywhere on the court, Ty Loomis is at home. When they say, where are you from? And he says, Georgia. And they're like, where'd you play in Georgia? You know, We never had a high school team here. We never really had club volleyball. Now you start to see some girls, high school teams and club volleyball, which is great for the sport. Loomis side. grew up playing baseball in Warner Robins, but it was at this apartment complex where the foundation for his career in volleyball was served at the University of California, Irvine, and now in the AVP circuit. My old baseball coach, uh, he, he wanted me to commit full time to baseball, but I always wanted a couple weekends off during the summer training to go play in some tournaments. And of course, he was pretty stubborn with, uh, you know, just playing baseball, just playing baseball the whole time. After growing a foot taller during his sophomore year in high school, he decided to focus primarily on volleyball, and that decision has paid off. This past 4th of July, Ty and his partner Casey Patterson won their first major tournament in the Coney Island Open, which was nationally televised. Oh, it was crazy. I was screaming. Um, my poor dog didn't know what was going on. I was just, I was at home watching it by myself and I was just going crazy. To get our first victory on that big of a stage was just incredible for us. So I'm still kind of smiling. Ty says this latest victory proves him that he belongs in a sport he loves no matter where he learned to play. We get paid to play beach volleyball. It's a tough life, huh? <laughs> Todd credits Coach David Bartley and several airmen from Robbins Air Force Base with teaching him the game. He was home visiting this past week. He's also preparing for the Manhattan Beach Open in California, which starts on Thursday. Thanks for tuning in for Morning Sports. Have a great Wednesday.